Hello and welcome. In this video we will learn how to play Can't Help Falling in Love, so make sure that your ukulele is tuned and let's get started. If you'd like to follow along with a PDF, check the link in the description box below. Alrighty, we are on line one. Let's go straight into it. You can watch the first time or you can play along. It's up to you. One, two, three, four. Think about your next chord. make sure you play that with your middle finger because after A minor we have F chord so that way you're already ready for F chord. If you're playing A minor with your index finger then you're gonna have to do a full switch and that will like kind of kill a little bit of time. So if you're there with A minor middle finger you can do it quickly. Okay the next two lines are exactly the same as the first two lines so let's just go straight through them. part in this song it's this next part but I'm gonna do a simplified version for you so that you don't have to freak out okay so I'm going to only strum on the note and then switch and then switch so watch me do it like a river flows, surely to the sea. If I were strumming throughout that part, I would have less time to switch over here. But I'm enchanting you with my singing, right? And while I'm doing that, I'm switching. So it's kind of a sneaky way to buy yourself a little bit more time. Okay, let's try that together. One, two, ready, go. Like a river flows, surely to the sea, darling, so Now if you want to add the finger style pattern, you don't have to, but if you want to, you want to get a little fancy, or maybe once you've learned this and you want to take it to the next level, click this card so that you can do the finger style pattern, but it would sound something like this. Totally optional. Alrighty, let's take it from the top. Take it from the top. One, two, ready, go.
version of the song, but all the chords would be the same on the extended version. So this is just something that we can do to learn how to play this song entry level. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this tutorial, please give me a thumbs up. And in the comments below, let me know where you're watching from. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Sayonara!